Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. So today is going to be a little different video because we went to Ikea and I've bought a, well, I've got a new drawer. And I'm actually going to put it like right there where uh, this one is. This one is a little bit bigger. The other one is going to be a little bit taller. And I want to place it like right here beside my bed. So we're just going to get it together. Going to put it like there and then i'm gonna take you with me how i put my stuff in the drawer because it's actually gonna be for my makeup so i think that's really exciting i hope you're excited too and let's get started so if you look around me i don't mind the messy bed don't mind the messy hair but you see something different right here and that's because i have a new drawer and today excuse me Today I'm going to put my makeup in it, so I'm going to give you a tiny little tour of all my makeup that I, well not all the products I own, but like the makeup I'm going to put right in there. Okay, so to start off with, I wanted to make a plan of what I was going to do, because it has seven drawers with the top one in it, Wait, I'm going to show you. When you look down, it has seven drawers, so the first one has a big mirror in it like hi and you can place some stuff in here but it's not too high as you can see let's close that then we have a small one another small one and then I have a four of these big ones and, and this one is big as well let me put this right there. Yeah, right. So uh, that's the uh, drawer we're gonna fill today. I am gonna show you my drawer where I have the makeup in now, but I'm gonna put the makeup in the drawer behind me because it's bigger and it fits like all the makeup because I have some stuff right here that doesn't fit in there and I actually wanted to fit in there like really badly. Don't mind the mess, I put it everything like around my room. So I can put stuff like on the new drawer but this is my skincare fridge I got this for my birthday so nothing is gonna go out of here but look how cute and then I have more stuff in here pretty pretty cute and then we have this drawer right there so the first drawer has lots of stuff in it like lip products blush highlighter right here i have some lip scrubs a liquid highlighters then i have some lashes beauty blenders makeup removing stuff right here i have like <laughs> so much different kind of stuff like this a primer mascara liners fake lashes then I have my foundations and powder. Then I have all parts of eyeshadow from different brands. And then I have my Jeffree Star drawer. And the last one is actually for my filming stuff. So I'm probably going to keep that in there. And these are my new lashes. If you've seen my video which I have filmed, I bought some stuff from Shein. And I bought like, there are dirty lashes. In this tiny little box this is one of them i think there are three different well how would you call that shades i'm not sure yet but yeah there are three different um numbers like three different kind of lashes i really really like this one but if you have not watched this video go watch it it's the i tried wigs from Shein video so let's go watch that so now you've seen the drawer you've seen the drawer it is in right now and i'm gonna tell you like a well i like stitch you probably already knew that stitch so adorable and i do like disney as well but look at this oh my god okay so i made a tiny little drawing in here i want to put everything in every drawer so my idea was to put the makeup remover stuff and the reusable wipes on the top one with the mirror on there then mascara fake lashes and things like that in the second one 
the third one which is still the tinier one I will put I hope highlighters and blushes and stuff like that then the fourth one is the first big one and I think putting lip products and foundation and stuff like that in there then the fifth drawer is gonna be my normal eyeshadow the sixth drawer is gonna be my Jeffree Star eyeshadows and then the seventh drawer is extra so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with that yet and like this is exactly what I just told you. I think I'm gonna take everything out of this drawer I already had, put it on the floor and then I'm gonna put it in this drawer, so. Okay, so <laughs> I made this tiny filming setup like right there because we don't have to see the last one because that's the filming style which I just told you. So I'm just, oh no, oh my god, they're still okay. Just gonna put the lashes aside really quick and then we're gonna start with taking out the makeup and I'm gonna start with the bottom drawer. At least the bottom drawer which we're gonna take out, so the Jeffree Star eyeshadow palettes. Oh and by the way, um, it's gonna be a tiny little tour of how I did everything in the end of the video in my new drawer, so if you wanna watch that, just keep looking. So the first drawer is empty. Let's go on to the uh, second one. So I've already put it on my eyeshadows, like the Jeffree Star ones here, and uh, the a uh, part of the normal ones here. I'm gonna continue putting other stuff right here. <laughs> Another drawer empty. Nice. <laughs> Let's continue with this drawer. And by the way, sorry if this angle is weird. I've not really done this before. And it's something I enjoy watching, so I want to try it. And then we're gonna go to the top drawer. That's the whole drawer empty, um, just not the bottom one, but I already told you that, so. I'm gonna give you a quick overview. This is definitely gonna fit. So I do still have to figure out where to put my camera while I'm doing this, but reusable wipes and makeup remover in the top one. So let's get started. Okay, I think it's gonna be the best view I can get because I have a tripod right now. I got it from my boyfriend for my birthday, but the tripod is for on the table, so or my bed right now. So I have uh, these ones which you can take your makeup off with. I'm gonna put it right there. Washing towels and three from a Stitch and Angel which is Stitch's girlfriend. A few makeup removers. I'm trying to make this one empty but I barely use this one. This one is for extra. I'm gonna put those two. <laughs> Not gonna put those two in here because they don't Fit. So it was not like working how I wanted it to, but I did make it work. So I made it uh, like this. So here are some tools right there, and here are the cloths, and then here you have the things to remove your makeup with too. So looking pretty good. And let's get onto the second drawer. Oh, and by the way, I'm uh, not sure how good this footage is gonna be or how long this video is gonna be so I hope you're actually enjoying this because I enjoy watching these videos normally I watch Paige Corn and she does like lots of um, declutter videos, collection videos and I always like really really enjoy watching those so I do have uh, two lush books Let's 
put all my fake lashes in here okay so i'm just gonna figure out which are the same with so i've used this one and i found some of that one which is actually a very big lash i have not used this one before but they look like so extra and so pretty and again another one whoa wow these look so extreme like can you see that wow i actually recently made a drag queen and it would have been perfect oh another one wow i didn't knew there were so many in here i thought it just were three different ones but another different one Even more different ones wow they look really pretty and fluffy oh my god another one wow very pretty there are one two three four five six different kind of lashes right here okay so you're again in a different angle but i thought now i have the top one done i can put you on the top of my drawer you can actually look inside of it like that would be like way more fun to watch what i'm actually doing so yeah <laughs> nice so you can see what's actually already in here which is the lash book The whole box is empty now, which is actually really, really nice. But I do have some different lashes in here, so I'm gonna put those in there too. And those lashes actually came from Primark, and I got this one from the Bushy Shop. I got this one for free, because I got a big order, I think. These ones are from Primark too, they look very pretty and big. Then I have some lash glue, I have a, a clipper, but I am going to put my fake curler in here because it didn't fit in the top one. I have to clean first, but I'm going to put this one in the top one as well. And now we're going to go on with mascara, which I'm going to put in right here. And I have lots of mascaras in here, so this is a mascara primer. A mini mascara, a blue one, a volume one, one from a Kiko, which I have never used. I got from a girl from my class, actually really, really sweet. A waterproof one, this one is blue as well. Ooh, oh my god, from MAC. A, a tiny one. Two of the Revlon ones never tried this one before a lilac one oh my god um now this is a primer setting spray primer i do have the uh, jeffree star fuck proof mascara and i have a dish too but I normally always use this two, this one for the top and this one for the bottom and I have them in my mini fridge which is right over there. And now we're gonna put these ones in here. I recently did a photo shoot at school and I used this blue one for the lashes obviously because mascara and it looked uh, so pretty. So I'm going to put the primer in there, new one, it's a new one because I put a new one there. Because <laughs> this was my favorite one, so there was a sale a while back from one plus one, so I got two and that's why I have two of these. And uh, this is how we're uh, looking. So all the mascaras right here, my lash curler is right there and then I have all my lashes on this side. So the next one we're gonna go in with is my highlighters and my blushes and it's gonna be in a tiny drawer as well. Let's make sure you can see lots better what I'm doing. These are liquid highlighters right here. Highlighters from Just Star Cosmetics, and this is a blush from a Morphe 2 line. This is actually really, really pretty. And this is a pressed blush. 
then I have this eyeshadow and a lipstick but you can use this one as blush too it has the same kind of tint it works really I'm gonna show you. it works really really nice like look how pretty that color is and you can fade it out like this so I'm gonna put that right there and then I have two other blushes one from a Bobbi Brown which I got from my boyfriend for Valentine it looks so pretty it's in a D shade Nectar and then I have one from Kimchi. <laughs> Look how pretty. And this is in the shade Peachy. That's our <laughs> actually all the blushes I own. Wait, I'm gonna put the liquid ones to the back. So then I have a two highlighters here from Over. This is actually too dark for me, but I do use it as a eyeshadow. And then I have this one, which is actually like nicely used. I have two tiny liquid ones from NYX. I got this in a in my very first advanced calendar. So I'm gonna put those back there too with the liquid stuff. This one was in the Fab Factory one. It's actually a really really pretty highlight. I'm not sure if you can see the glow, but I absolutely love this one, so I'm gonna keep that back there too. Have a Fenty Beauty highlighter in the blue shade. It's called Chills Metal Crush from KBD Beauty. This one's so pretty. It's a gold school. So then my favorite highlighter from Jeffree Star Cosmetics, as you can see, it's a Skin Frost in the shade Ice Cold. Then I have. A Supreme Frost and an Extreme Frost. So this is the Supreme Frost. Such a amazingly cool color. And the Extreme Frost. Amazing. This is so cool. And then I have a highlighter from MAC. It's a really pretty more subtle one in this shade Soft and Gentle. And I am going to put my powder in here, my bronzer in here. I do have another finishing powder. And eyebrow stuff is going to go somewhere else. I do own a facial palette from Benefit, but it's actually now in my school bag because I do makeup for school. So that will be probably in here very, very soon. But this is what the drawer is looking like. So the liquid stuff is... Behind, wait, can you see? Yeah, behind there. And we have all of the normal, well, normal highlighters right here. The blushes right here and then the excess stuff right there. And that's the second drawer all finished. I'm gonna first do uh, the first big drawer and oh my god i'm out of frame i'm out of frame okay and the first one is for the lip products and the foundations so let's open her up okay you can see from here and there goes a little bit into there too but i'm gonna show you later on let me show you i have uh, these uh, lip scrubs right here from a uh, jeffree star cosmetics I do have another cute lip scrub from a Disney. It's Coconut Crush Lip Scrub and it's from the Primark. But look how cute it is. It has Angel on the top of it, Stitch's girlfriend. And I think I'm actually gonna keep using these ones in here because this one is actually really big and I can put this one in here like very easily. And these are my lip products. And these are my lip products. Yeah, I know it's much so. What I'm gonna do now is I am first gonna put all the lip products on my bed and then I can decide how I want to sort it out and I'm gonna show you how I'm doing that. So yeah. It was a little bit like all over the place. I'm like trying my best. It looks so professional in other people's videos, but I'm not really sure how to do it myself. I'm trying my best. So I just hope you like watching it. <laughs> At least I enjoy filming it. So that's an important part too. Okay, so I want to keep my normal lips lipsticks together, my liquid lipsticks, and 
my lip glosses for sure. Let's try the lip glosses first. So I'm gonna get one of these. It's gloss bomb from Fenty, one from friends. I have a couple of Jeffrey Star ones right here. Um yeah, this is a a supreme gloss, so this is actually a gloss too. And this a Too Faced one is a gloss and then these two from Pat McGrath are actually lip glosses too. Yeah, they're like, oh my god, no, the lip glosses, they're so cute, like, so pretty. Then I have some mini butter glosses, so I'm gonna take a look and putting all of those in here as well. Okay, so those are all of the glosses and I'm gonna put this one aside now and we're gonna go to uh, the liquid lipsticks. So I do have lots of liquid lipsticks from Jeffstar Cosmetics as you can see right here. So I'm gonna put those in there. This is like a very very old collection. Actually the first liquid lipsticks I got them from my ex-boyfriend. Okay, so putting all those in. Another very cute collection this is more Christmas vibes, I think. I'm not really sure anymore. But I really enjoy the bottle of these, and these colors are like so pretty. This one. And then I have a some from uh, the normal collection, which has the pink tops on it. And then I have the whole collection from Jeffrey and Shane Dawson, which I do all have separate videos of. This Fenty one is a lip paint. I'm gonna put this one here because it actually stays. Then I have two of these Maybelline Super Matte Ink. So I'm gonna put those in here as well. Lip Crayon from House Laboratories is amazing. It keeps like everything on your lips for the whole day. So really, really cool. I'm gonna put this one. I, by the way, have one lip liner from Jeff Star Cosmetics. I do have some other colors in my makeup bag for school, but this color is actually is so wait, so so pretty. But I'm gonna put it in here too. Putting this one aside, and then we're gonna go to the normal lipsticks. I have a black one from Mac. These are the velvet ones from Jeff Style Cosmetics and these are the older bullets, which I still really enjoy. Then I have three lipsticks from Morphe. I do have another one from uh, this collection. I did film a video of this collection and I do have that one in my school bag. Then I have uh, this. I have these tiny uh, NYX soft matte lip creams. And then I have this one from Kiko Milani. Wait. I have way more space here. Okay, so I'm gonna put the lip liner in here instead of in there. So it stays better. And this is with normal lipsticks too. So I'm gonna put this right here too. And those are actually like all the lip products. Yeah, I do have some older ones in right here so I'm gonna show you this one is one I actually don't use anymore but it looks so cute and I just don't want to get rid of it because it looks so adorable it's for my dad work and I've used like a lot 
of this. Ah. Uh, then I have this one which I bought in 2015 vacation holiday. I have used a lot of it. It's such a pretty a color though. And then I have this one which I got from how old was I? <laughs> I think I was eight or something. So I'm not using this, I'm just keeping it for sentimental reasons. And then I have this one which I still have oh my god. Yeah. Which I still have to give to my friend, but I forget so uh, forgot by the way. So I'm gonna keep those in a jar. We're gonna move you up there again and we're gonna put this stuff in the drawer. So we still have the lip scrubs here. I'm gonna put uh, this one in the back. My uh, glasses right here. My uh, liquid lipsticks right there. And the uh, normal lipsticks right here. And it fits perfect. Like, oh my god, you have to see this. Like. Doesn't that fit like amazingly in there? Nice, so let's go into the other drawer. Now we're gonna go on with this drawer and it's gonna be my normal eyeshadow palette. So I'm just gonna put all my eyeshadow palettes on my bed and then I'll be right back to put them in this one. Okay, so here we have all my normal eyeshadow palettes and by uh, normal i mean not jeffree star eyeshadow palettes because i almost have all of this so i'm gonna put these ones in the drawer i do think i'm gonna keep the tiny ones in here because it's easier for me i'm gonna put uh, this sueva liner in here because i do already have a colourpop liner in there too so i'm gonna put that in the back then i have uh, some bigger palettes which are gonna go in the back too. Um, a tinier eyeshadow palette, which, yeah, I can actually place these ones here. Then my newer, more favorite eyeshadow palettes, it's the Toddy Beauty one. It's so, so pretty. Like, oh my god, I'm so sad you can't buy this anymore. I'm really happy I have it in my collection, to be honest. This doesn't fit. Oh my god, it doesn't fit. Wait, I'm gonna put these ones over there for now. And I do have this Pat McGrath and the Huda Beauty one, which I actually have very have bought very recently. This one can go there. Okay, so let's take a look. <coughs> can go here to this place to this one can go there and uh, these are more a tiny ones so my eyeshadows are now all in there I'm not sure okay I'll keep it like this it looks very pretty what my eyeshadow drawer looks like so these are the tiny ones and these are the normal ones like I just told you Cool. <laughs> now we're gonna go with the drawer beneath it and that's gonna be my Jeffree Star Cosmetics eyeshadow drawer So I'm gonna put all of those on my bed now and I'm gonna put them in here just like I did with these ones Oh my god, I'm so so stupid. I forgot to put my Morphe Melty ones in Somewhere in my drawer. So let's take a look of where I'm gonna place it. Not the lip drawer Wait, does it fit in here? Oh my god, they do fit in here. Okay, so I'm gonna place all the Morphe ones. Wait, oh my god, you're way too zoomed in. So that's better. So I'm gonna put all my Morphe ones in the drawer with the highlighters and blushes. And that's like really okay because it has a blush in here and it has a highlighter in here too. So I'm going to put all of these in front of uh, the liquid highlighters. So, like uh, that. This is the almost lost drawer and I'm going to put all of my Jeffree Star Cosmetics ones in here. So, 
blood sugar, blue, blood money, blue blood, conspiracy, a pink religion, and this one is actually like bigger than my lost drawer, so it fits in here like really nice all standing up. Do they stand up? No, they're too big. Okay, so the orgy palette is gonna go right there, then I have the cremated and the uh, jaw breaker on top. Alien palette, I'm not gonna fit there, okay. So the alien palette goes underneath here. Wait, is there a hair? Oh my god, is there? Does uh, this one fit? Uh, no, it's not. Okay, so this one fits in here too, together with the prick palette. And I still have Thirsty, Androgyny, and a Beauty Killer, which are gonna go next to the pink one, and my three minis, which make all of them fit in here like perfectly. I do have a couple things left that I wanna put in here. Those are actually my beauty sponges, my makeup removers, and my foundation. So I'm gonna put you back on there, gonna take a look of where I wanna place that, and putting that right in there. Oh, and by the way, um, I forgot this whole thing, so that has to go in here too. Okay, so I'm gonna put my foundations in uh, my lipstick drawer because there are just like four of these and two of these are like older. Um, this is a newer one, this is an old one, this is an older one, which is almost like, oh, sorry, which is almost empty, and uh, this is a, a newer one. So I'm gonna keep those in here. Yeah, I'm gonna do so. I'm gonna put all my... Oh, I'm, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna put all my Jeffree stuff in the lowest one. Because I didn't consider like... Measurizing everything right, so... I'm gonna put everything I have in here in the bottom drawer. So. By the way, I just put it in this color pop because I forgot to put it in when I filmed this part. Then I'm gonna put my lip products one down. This is the third row on top where I had my lip products first and what I'm actually gonna do now is I'm gonna keep my foundations in here, my beauty blenders and I'm gonna put these ones in there too and I think I'll be putting the Morphe ones in there too. Now I can actually like put my makeup removers in here. Now I'm giving you a quick overview. So I put my makeup brushes right there. And I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna put on my mirror on here, which I usually do. Then we have the first drawer. Hi. I put some extra stuff in there and made it look like kind of really cute. Easy to take these out. Then we have the second drawer with all uh, the fake lashes and the mascaras. I did put it my lash glue right here because it didn't fit in like here properly. Then we have the third row with highlighters, liquid highlighters, blushes, bronzer and powder. This drawer has the Morphe thingies, the extras, makeup sponges, and foundations, and makeup remover products. 
then we have all of the lip products in the whole drawer all the un normal eyeshadows and palettes and the last drawer is all of my Jeffree Star eyeshadow palettes and that's actually my whole drawer right now and I'm kind of really happy with it okay I'm sorry for the weird lighting but as you can see like the sun is coming through okay so that's like my full uh, new drawer all complete. I actually love the way it is like looking right now. I'm really happy how it turned out and I hope you enjoyed watching this. So if you did, please give this a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet and turn on the notifications so you get a notification every time I upload a brand new video. But for now, I hope you enjoyed this video. Comment down below what kind of video you want me to film next. And I hope you have a nice day and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>